You are welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Yaku Mohammed. Today I want to do one small video to show us how I overload the work. For this event, I don't I don't program the the card to handle only 750 VA of power with a power factor of 0 0.8, means in around 600 watts of load you could carry. And we are exit 600 watts, the guy is supposed to shut down. So make I power, I'm not going to just run this small test. So you see, with all the program on top, the power is 750 V. So like I said, if you convert that one to watt, around the around the 600 watt. So for here, I get two bulbs. Each of these bulbs now two 200 watt of bulb. It's not filament bulb. Then I get a, a drilling machine. This drilling machine now 400 watt. So I mean 400 watt. So in total, I get 800 watt of load. So by default, this um, inverter not will fit. Fit carrier, or maybe possibly the inverter go shut down once you overload them. So let's try it and see. Okay, it's on. So I can try the, the drilling machine. So, see the signal for the drilling machine. Okay, the current machine. Let's try one more power. Okay. Let's try another 200 watts. Remember, see now the device now 600 watts they carry. All right, so they carry 400 watt of load. So the voltage, so the current when they draw around 37.8. I'm sliding the draw from and the draw. So let's uh, power this guy now on. So just for now. So we see it all shut down. So we check out now. See see it all shut down. That's shutting down. So we see now OLSD. OL means an overload shutdown. So make I on them again if you on them. So no, no, that that was just off. I don't offer. So make a run them again. All right, it's all on again. So this is it. They carry the load. They carry 400 watts comfortably. So let's try it again. Let's try the the. They don't shut down. So this is not the overload test. So some of us they don't shut down. So this is not the overload test for the inverter. So far, so good. Overload they work. But if I want to make it carry this um this man this machine, I will just need to go back, go reprogram the the control card, make it handle up to 800 watts. I feel put that for 1000 V because the transformer is supposed to be carried up to 1000 V. My MOSFET uh MOSFET supposed to be drive up to 1000 V. But for this test, I just want to show us how the cut of the work. Um the cut of they use this uh they use um <clears throat> Use our current sensors now. The current sensor with this, so it goes through the current source from the inverter to the current sensor. So now, here for power this guy, and then uh, it goes to power the two of them from here. So that is it. Uh, once again, when also the laser appeal to us, see more to try and uh, hit our like button, of course, hit our like button, uh, subscribe to our channel so that we will get and um, we will feel, we feel encouraged us to, to, to do more videos. Once again, thank you for taking your time to watch our video. Thank you.